This is it, the main event. The house is rocking and the robots are about to roll into battle. That's right, Dave, it's the main event. The House Robot Rebellion, where Humdrum and Squirmin' Vermin will try to survive. From New York, Squirmin' Vermin. Squirmin' Vermin, a little yellow 209-pound bot with a pneumatic lifter and some major flammability. From Minnesota, Humdrum. And the awesome spinner of Humdrum at 220 pounds. He's got two maces on a spinning drum that you better stay out of the way of. Robotier, stand by. And there's Andrew Cariotti at the controls for Squirm and Vermin, and Eric Domhold, 13, for Humdrum. And they will be fighting it out to try to survive the house bots, Dead Metal, and Shunt. This is a pretty tall order. Let's see if they can hang. Three, two, one, activate. Well, here we go, Humdrum. Squirm and Vermin off to a quick start. Squirm and Vermin is doing just that in between the house spots. And the spinning power of Humjump sent him flying off a shot. Shot definitely with a weight advantage here. And Squirm and Vermin's nose goes flying across the arena as Shot tries to bury the accident. It's a four way tag team tussle here with the house spots all locked up. Humdrum not doing a whole lot of moving all of a sudden as Shunt is pushing him ever closer to that pit. Somebody's hit that trigger and Dead Metal is burying that saw right into Squirm and Vermin. Well, the house bots are just too awesome for these guys. Poor Squirm and Vermin never had a chance. So what do these challengers have to learn about this round? Don't mess with the house bots. As Shunt drags Squirm and Vermin close to the mouse hole, and he's about ready to go down. Or is he? Squirm and Vermin's hanging on for dear life there as Humdrum hasn't done a lot of moving. And what's that door in the middle of the arena opening and the smoke coming out? It's Sir K. As if these guys needed any more help. He's looking real impatient. And look at that soft dead metal go through Humdrum. Sir K is looking for any extra little tidbits, little robo scraps to pick up. Wow, this is really unfair. Look at that squirming vermin held high above the arena, just wriggling helplessly as Sir K dumps him out of the arena. And the crowd love that little departure. Wow, as Shut now goes into humdrum. They are just looking in disbelief up in the Humdrum booth. And Sir K comes in for a bit of cleanup, too, on Humdrum with those pincers. Over a ton of pressure in him, crushes poor Humdrum and drags him lifeless to the center of the arena. Uh-oh, it's the drop zone. He's putting something above it. There's a box of some sort sitting on top of that drop zone. As the ref cam looks on, poor Humdrum is about to get mashed up. What's gonna come out of there? Nobody knows. It's a bunch of scrap metal, which is exactly what Humdrum Six. has been reduced to. Look at that. Over 80 feet up in the air, just drops down on Humdrum's lifeless carcass. Well, they had a good beginning, but they sure had a sorry end. Nobody beats the house bots. Here with the teams, and first of all, the Squirm and Vermin team, Andy, I, I think this belongs to you. Yes. The nose, pretty much all that's left. It's hard enough when you have to compete against each other, but then you have to compete against the house bots. I mean, how tough is that? Uh, it's very hard to control it. It's difficult to move, and then they hit you, and it goes downhill from there. And they hit you, and they hit you, and they hit you one more time, right? They keep banging on you until you die, pretty much. <laughs> and if that wasn't hard enough, all of a sudden, Sir K comes into the mix. Now, after facing those house bots and realizing how tough they are and how awesome they are, if you had a chance to go back and, and fix your robot, what do you think you might add to your robot to be able to compete with the house bots? Put some tape around our removable link because that came off. 
Yeah, tape and, and bandages, I think. <laughs> lots and lots of bandages. All right, that does it for another edition of Nickelodeon Robot Wars. Make sure you guys join us next time to see some more of the world's greatest robots in action. See you later. And remember, building robots is extremely dangerous and should not be attempted without great care and parental supervision. For more information, please visit www.nick.com. <laughs>